It wasn't a disaster, but it could have gone better. Here's a few notes from the game. Really outstanding work by El Salvador on delaying our national anthem. I think they deserve a lot of credit for it. The first domino to fall is Dest has a habit of staring directly into camera briefly while it passes. But since the cameraman has to go back, it doesn't pass. He has to pull out of that. Raina notices that. And then what happens is we just go into a long delay, which then gives everyone time to think about what just happened. And the, dealing with a second camera pass is always going to be difficult, particularly for a young team, particularly on the road. First World Cup qualifiers. Firework was an excellent touch on the second pass. Uh, bigger issues. Now Desk can't even look at the camera to get any rhythm going early. It was an off-finishing night for us. That's sometimes how it goes. But I want to give some recognition to Miles here. He does can't convert, but commits the face slide. And it's actually one of the longer face slides I've, I've personally ever seen. Maybe more impressive is just how he maintains body shape throughout it. This, this really might have been the highlight of the game. Not only was Reyna our best player versus El Salvador, it also argue somewhat counterintuitively that we're seeing some positive improvements in his leadership through body language. These aren't the best examples of that, but in, in these cases, his teammates are doing a genuinely bad job. The place where we're, I think we're seeing the improvement is in plays where you might expect him to have done bad body language, but he doesn't. Like, he could have gotten past the ball here. I don't think the angle was there, but that normally doesn't matter to him. Just watching the play, it looked like a place he'd throw his arms up, but he didn't. And then the other common area where we might see it, but didn't sometimes in this game, was when he creates something, and then the pl teammate hasn't made the run, but he just kept going on this play. And this time, uh, I forgot, he does do some body language on this time, but just those two previous examples, I think we're seeing some improvement just from that. I was thinking this was a, a third example, but I got the clips confused. Brendan does, he does seem to make that run, though. This is really shithousing in its highest form, and, and not something I could ever do justice to in any kind of analysis, but I just just want to say how much respect I have for Henry Kessler as a, as a player, and really as a human being. 90% of players aren't even going to deal with the second ball, and of those that do, 99% of them are just going to maybe knock it over the edge. It's the invention to throw it in those stands is, is what makes him a potentially generational shithouser, in my opinion.